breaking news. Hawaii Volcano Eruption Update, USGS fears years will pass before Kailaia lava empties. Hawaii's erupting Kailaia volcano could take many more years before it fully empties its underground reservoirs of molten lava, United States Geological Survey, USGS. Scientists gravely warned. Scientists fear the lava released by Kailaia so far has not even scratched the surface of its hidden magma reserves. When asked if the Hawaii volcano's chambers will empty any time soon, the U.S. agency admitted there is no accurate way of knowing. The USGS said, We're not exactly sure how much magma is stored beneath the summit. We have only estimates but we are confident it is at least in excess of 100 times what has been erupted so far from Fisher 8. So we would need years of the current eruption rate to empty the summit. The pressure beneath the summit is already quite low, so it's unlikely that such a scenario could ever come into play. Some level of pressure is needed to drive the magma from the summit to the lower east rift zone eruption site. The USGS added it is also unlikely the Kailaia summit will collapse in on itself despite intense volcanic activity around this slumping crater. The news comes after data collected by European Space Agency, ASA, satellites revealed rapid deformation of the volcano's summit. So we would need years of the current eruption rate to empty the summit United States Geological Survey and on Sunday, June 17, at 6.26 MHST. 5.26 p.m. BST, the USGS recorded a small explosive collapse of Kailaia's volatile summit. At least four volcanic fissures in the Lower East Rift Zone are currently active with strong lava fountaining from Fissure 8 in the Ilani area. The USGS said, fountain ranging between 60 and 165 feet from the Fissure 8 spatter can continue to feed lava into the well-established channel that flows to the ocean at Kapoa. Occasionally, minor amounts of lava briefly spill over the channel levees. The ocean entry remain fairly broad with lays blown onshore. Fissures 16 and 18 continue to ooze lava. Since Kailaia's eruption began on May 3 this year, lava flows have covered more than 9.2 square miles of land.